Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel, and uh, well, it is the day of the week for the Google Chrome weekly update today, as uh, one update or one security flow is fixed. So if you go to your Google Chrome browser, upper right corner, the three vertical dots, go into Help and About Google Chrome. It'll be moved to version 135.0. That's 7049.114 or 115, depending on Linux, Mac, or Windows. So this fixes one security flaw that has pretty much no information. They're not mentioning what it is. Uh, Google does that a lot when the security flaws are discovered. If they can just, you know, keep quiet on what exactly it is the flaw. They usually do so that they don't give any hints to the bad guys out there, which I guess is not a bad idea. But for people like us that like to know where it comes from, uh, where it is, and what is the flaw, it's a bad thing. Uh, there's no severity also in the security flaw. It doesn't say if it's a high severity, critical, or anything. So one security flaw that has not much information. Um, depending on where it is, it could actually be also in Chromium for the rest of the browsers. It will depend where it was and what exactly it fixes. Some security flaws sometimes are unique to just one version of a web browser, so it's not always the case that it moves on to other uh, browsers. It really depends if it's a Chromium flaw that is common to all the browsers out there. So do update uh, just in case, you never know and make sure that uh, you stay safe. Updates are the number one reason, the number one way to stay safe, whether it is through Windows, through your browser, your favorite software that you use all the time, uh, because it just f closes security flaws that are often exploited in the wild or exploited by bad guys online. If you fix the flaw, well, they just can't exploit it, which means their malware becomes useless. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.